So they give you these really long chopstick things, tongs. <laughs> they give you tongs. <laughs> It's dinner time, and my mom and I are here at Shabu Shabu Zen in Rancho Mirage, California. And it is a Shabu Shabu place, obviously. I will let you know what we decide to get, and I'll see you guys as soon as we order. So, the first step is you choose your broth, and it has the option of Shabu Shabu broth. You can get the authentic miso or sukiyaki. So, my mom is getting sukiyaki, and I'm getting the miso. And then you can choose from your meats. So, so we're both going to do the American Wagyu beef, and we're going to do the option of the more meat, less vegetables, because let's be real, that's the whole point of coming here. <laughs> but if you're not into that, they do have um, seafood, they have tofu, they have a vegetarian one. So you can also add on some extras like udon noodles or ramen noodles. Very cool stuff. So they just brought the sauces and they give you sesame seeds that you ground into a paste and then add garlic into it. Or you can use the ponzu sauce and it has daikon, was it daikon? Daikon radish that you can add to the ponzu sauce. And then there's green onion that you can add to either one. And so you can kind of mix and choose what you want to use for your dipping sauce. Very neat. So they use induction cooktops here and they bring you the pot of broth and then they turn the induction cooktop on and the broth ends up heating up. So when the meat comes, you can cook your meat in the broth. Very fun, very cool, and just kind of a unique experience. So you basically grab a piece of your beef or whatever you're using and then you put it in your broth and swish, swish, swish. I thought that's what it was supposed to be. Shabu Shabu was swish, swish, swish. And it's like magic. I'm Harry Potter after three seconds. My beef has turned from pink to brown. And then we dip it in the sauce. Try the sesame sauce first. I think the sesame is the one I like the best. Mmm. So good. Mm. Let's try the ponzu sauce. Mmm. Both of those sauces are super good. Oh, perfect. Thank you. I think we're good right now. So, the sesame sauce is a little bit more savory, and it does have kind of a nuttier flavor versus the ponzu sauce it has that citrusy taste to it both are really good um, I would recommend definitely trying both out so good I'm like a kid in a candy store except replace candy with beef <laughs> so they just brought over the vegetables and noodles and it has um, tofu there's what is this cabbage or is this bok choy this is, um, they brought over bok choy, they have noodles, there's lettuce, carrots, what is this, mushroom? Weird little mushroom things. Enoki? Enoki mushrooms. My mom's so knowledgeable. <laughs> So these usually take a little bit longer to cook, so I actually don't care for the lettuce. 
Get out of here, lettuce. You're not welcome. <laughs> I don't know if Carly's going to let you hear my singing of sukiyaki. <laughs> uh, the potato croquettes are fabulous. The okonomiyaki is one of the few places you can get it that I know of outside of Japan or Los Angeles. So I highly recommend this restaurant if you come to the Coachella. <laughs> Dinner was fabulous. If you guys are in the Palm Springs area and you're looking for something kind of unique as far as dining, I would highly recommend coming to Shabu Shabu Zen in Rancho Mirage. It is about 10 minutes from downtown Palm Springs, so it's not too far. And it really is a great experience. It's fun, it's interactive. Whether you're here by yourself, with family, with friends, with a loved one, um, honestly, it's such a great place to come and have dinner. So definitely would recommend. Um, it is a little bit on the pricier side. As you saw, it was about $50 per person, 60 with taxes. Um, but honestly, I think it's worth it. So again, five stars, love coming here. And that's pretty much it guys for today's video. There is gonna be a part two coming of our Palm Springs Eats, but this is gonna wrap up part one. So thank you so much for watching. If you guys like this video, make sure that you hit the subscribe button down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.